Hi, this is Paul. I want to make a quick video about, you know, President Trump. Um, I'm just counting down the days until he hope, he hopefully loses the election by a lot, hopefully by a landslide. Because this idiot, you know, put out a tweet saying that uh, that maybe we should uh, uh, delay the election, even though he has no power to do that. Only Congress can do that. But I shouldn't be surprised that he, he's trying to throw that out there because he sees the polls and everyone in these major states saying that he's behind Joe Biden and he's scared to death because he knows once he he doesn't he loses the election that more than likely and this is more likely that he's going to jail okay and once he gets out of that White House okay there's a lot of people waiting with silver bracelets for him and he's scared to death so he's trying to do anything to distract delay frustrate obfuscate and he can act like a little child all he wants to and say uh, oh the election was rigged or whatever and, so, and try to stop it and all this stuff trying to stop voting and all this stuff but at the end of the day if he tries to delay it after he loses and tries to hang out in the White House, uh, if I was Joe Biden, okay, I have the Secret Service, since you're the president of the left, I have the Secret Service grab him, but taser him and toss his ass out right in front of the street, right in front of the White House. I do it right on, I, I tell reporters to be waiting for it. Okay, on the day that he's officially supposed to take office, I'd have them do it. I have the Secret Service grab him, okay, taser him and carry him out and toss him right into the street, okay? Like the piece of crap that he is, okay? Because he's trying to just delay and distract. He knows because all these people that have died because of coronavirus is on his watch, and he's responsible for all these deaths. Over 150,000 Americans have died because of him and his incompetent leadership, okay? So I don't give a crap what he says about anything. He deserves to lose. He, deserve, he actually deserves to be prosecuted and put in jail for the coronavirus thing alone, not all the other crimes he's committed. Okay, if there's any justice in this world, that's what's going to happen as soon as he gets out of the White House. Okay, he's a piece of crap, and I, and I can't stand him, and I just can't wait until the election day is over and it's done and over. And all these idiots that follow him, too, okay, you can go to jail, too, right behind him, too. He's a, he's a freaking moron, but I wouldn't be surprised if this coward runs to Russia, okay, because that, that's how much of a coward he is. Okay, anyway, let me know what you think. Feel free to leave comments down below. And this is Paul saying so long, and take care.